The coffee industry contributes to 80% of Timor Leste's annual non oil exports. However, the country's coffee export has been dropping sharply for two consecutive years due to the COVID 19 pandemic. Chen Li Song, a Chinese expatriate in Timor Leste, has been involved in the coffee industry for 17 years. He even has the president of Timor Leste as one of his loyal customers. However, his coffee house has been quieter as the cost of materials and labor continue to rise amid the pandemic and the current global instability. Uh the pandemic has also affected the supply chain and logistics of the coffee industry in Timor Leste. In order to boost the recovery of the coffee industry and national economy, the government has launched a coffee rehabilitation program aimed at enhancing policy support and boosting financial input. We have the, pro uh, the project that uh, the, pro the production must be increased uh, to 170% every year. At the moment, we just uh, produce less than uh, 10,000 tons. Means the next five years, we are able, we are possible to produce more than uh, 40 or 30,000 tons a year. Timor Leste currently exports most of their coffee as a commodity grade product with little to no differentiation. However, global demand for specialty coffees is growing rapidly and this provides a great window for Timor-Leste to gain better export prices.